Hey everyone, welcome to the situational photography lesson about landscapes. In these lessons, we're just giving you five practical tips to improve your photography in whatever situation it may be. So today we're talking about landscapes. So number one tip of the day is light is magic. Shooting at dawn or dusk will make your landscape photos absolutely gorgeous. So this is the first half hour to an hour where you start to see the sunrise and then half an hour before the sun sets and then even after the sun sets and goes beyond the horizon. This creates some great lighting. Number two tip is to use a polarizing filter that boosts sky saturation. So we talked about filters in the lenses section so go back to that one if you want to find out more about what polarizing filters are but what they basically do is create a more contrasted and saturated look for skies. Tip number three is when you're shooting a landscape make sure that your depth of field is very wide so that most of the photo is sharp. So use a smaller aperture like f stop 22 or just a wide angle lens that will have a deeper depth of field. Tip number four is to use a tripod for ultra steady shots and you can even have a longer shutter speed due to the smaller f-stop like I mentioned before and make sure that you reduce your ISO to have a super clean image but basically tip number four is bring a tripod if necessary. And the last one, tip number five, is to think about the lines in your shot, especially if you're shooting a horizon or a skyline, or even though a skyline is not necessarily a landscape, but a mountaintop or any sort of lines in your, in your image, think about it. And you can use the rule of thirds and put them on that lower third line or not. You can put them really high or really low in your image, but just remember to think about the lines that are in your image. Okay, so that's your five tips for taking better landscapes.